Welcome to Future Human Science, where we explore the fascinating world of technology and science. Today, we're diving into a topic that powers much of our modern lives, the science of batteries. Have you ever wondered how batteries store and release energy, or what makes them so crucial in our everyday devices? In this video, we'll uncover the science behind batteries and explore how they work, from their basic principles to their diverse applications. Let's start with the basics. What is a battery? At its core, a battery is a device that stores and converts chemical energy into electrical energy. This stored energy can then be used to power a wide range of devices, from smartphones and laptops to electric vehicles and renewable energy systems. Batteries come in various sizes and types, but they all operate on the same fundamental principles. A battery consists of three main components, two electrodes and an electrolyte. The electrodes are typically made of different materials and are referred to as the anode and the cathode. The anode is the negative electrode, while the cathode is the positive electrode. The electrolyte is a substance that facilitates the flow of ions between the anode and cathode. This flow of ions is essential for the battery's operation. When a battery is connected to a circuit, a chemical reaction occurs at the electrodes. At the anode, a chemical reaction releases electrons, which flow through the external circuit to the cathode. This flow of electrons generates an electric current that can be used to power electronic devices. Simultaneously, positive ions move through the electrolyte from the anode to the cathode, maintaining electrical neutrality and completing the circuit. The process of discharging a battery involves the release of stored chemical energy. During this process, the chemical reactions at the electrodes produce electrical energy, which is used to power the connected device. As the battery discharges, the chemical reactants are consumed, and the battery's capacity gradually diminishes. When the battery is recharged, the process is reversed. An external power source applies a voltage to the battery, driving the electrons back to the anode and restoring the chemical reactants. This allows the battery to be used again, storing energy for future use. Different types of batteries have different charging and discharging characteristics, depending on their chemistry and design. There are several types of batteries, each with its own advantages and applications. Let's explore some of the most common types. Alkaline batteries. These are perhaps the most familiar type of battery, commonly used in household devices like remote controls and flashlights. Alkaline batteries use a zinc anode and a manganese dioxide cathode with an alkaline electrolyte. They offer a high energy density and long shelf life, but are typically single use and cannot be recharged. Lithium-ion batteries. These batteries are widely used in portable electronics, such as smartphones, laptops, and electric vehicles. Lithium-ion batteries have a high energy density, lightweight design, and long cycle life. They use lithium compounds as the electrode materials and an electrolyte that allows lithium ions to move between the electrodes during charging and discharging. Lead acid batteries. Lead acid batteries are commonly used in automotive applications, such as car batteries. They have a lower energy density compared to lithium ion batteries, but are known for their reliability and cost effectiveness. Lead acid batteries use lead dioxide as the positive electrode, sponge lead as the negative electrode, and sulfuric acid as the electrolyte. Nickel metal hydride, NIMH batteries. NIMH batteries are often used in rechargeable household devices, such as digital cameras and cordless phones. They offer a higher capacity than alkaline batteries and are rechargeable. NIMH batteries use a nickel oxide hydroxide electrode and a hydrogen absorbing alloy as the negative electrode. Solid state batteries. 
An emerging technology, solid-state batteries use a solid electrolyte instead of a liquid or gel electrolyte. This design has the potential to offer higher energy densities, improved safety, and longer lifespans. Solid-state batteries are still in the development stage, but hold promise for future applications. The efficiency and performance of batteries are influenced by various factors, including the materials used, the design of the electrodes, and the type of electrolyte. Researchers are continuously working to improve battery technology, focusing on increasing energy density, enhancing safety, reducing costs, and extending lifespan. One of the key challenges in battery technology is improving energy density, which refers to the amount of energy a battery can store relative to its size and weight. Higher energy density means longer-lasting batteries that are more compact and lightweight. Advances in material science, such as the development of new electrode materials and electrolytes, are driving progress in this area. Another important consideration is battery safety. Batteries can sometimes overheat, leak, or even explode if they are damaged or improperly handled. Researchers are working on developing safer battery designs and materials to mitigate these risks. Additionally, improving battery recycling and disposal methods is crucial for minimizing environmental impact and reducing waste. The future of battery technology is closely tied to advancements in renewable energy and electric transportation. Batteries play a crucial role in storing energy from renewable sources like solar and wind, enabling a stable and reliable energy supply. In the automotive industry, advances in battery technology are driving the development of electric vehicles with longer ranges and faster charging times. In conclusion, the science of batteries is a dynamic and rapidly evolving field that is essential to modern technology. From the basic principles of how batteries store and release energy to the latest advancements in battery technology, understanding batteries is key to appreciating the innovations that power our world. Thank you for joining us on this exploration of the science of batteries. If you found this video insightful and want to learn more about the technology shaping our future, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon so you never miss an update from future human science. Until next time, stay curious and keep exploring the wonders of science and technology with us.